they look me koro koro, or they hear me whine whine, I be say you turn that gilly bar on top of the, I go raise my two hand. Chairman television station, Wazobia TV channel 98 on top of Go TV cable, Star Time channel 195, my TV channel 17, UHF 57, where all you need to do, not to turn your antenna small, and on top of DSTV channel 259. As we they do, Mondays and Thursdays, we don't come again with that Ogonga Palace diet of discussion when concerned politics inside the border of Nigeria. Where you, as a Nigerian, we go give you the power to tap your mind as it take concern this country. Because now we go do make our country better. My name now is Ugo Chokode. And as usual, I know the alone inside studio. I deal with my brother. When Sammy well well, as they concern the politics matter, as it is. Oh. Yes, um, good evening, uh, Nigerians, and welcome to another beautiful edition of um, on our program, Ask Ide Hoda Political Program, with the sun with out um, political activities, where they happen for both Nigeria. Today, we're not different, because uh, we're supposed to, um, at least, we anticipate somebody to make you join us later, uh, but while we still wait, um, make our at least, uh, we'll get um, a lot of interesting stories. We'll go to the sun and we we'll go also day up to date with the activities that happen for both Nigeria. Three, three, three uh, interesting stories. I, I like, let me say, four interesting stories. At least by the time we search now, all these stories now, we also figure the license to call in. Contribute in our own quarter. Make you not say yes to the matter we concern Nigeria. At least our problem. And for us to also get our right. Now, collective hand, we need to come together to ensure that we do it. We get them right. My name is Asiche. My name remains Unkubi. And this is As In the Heart. Our first story on top of As In the Heart, get to do it. What did we say? In the Heart. Hmm. Now, if you check the political boxing ring of our great country, Nigeria, we now say last weekend a lot of action being happened. Because if you check the calendar of INEC, as it takes concern when political parties must complete their primary, mm -hmm. primary now where political parties them go gather within themselves, choose people when we say go fly the flag of the party for the general election. Best don't say INEC don't put up say October 7 to mm -hmm. make everybody don't complete their primaries, that is all the political parties. And that weekend, we see plenty of action, waiting on people who they call a flurry of activities. And of the 91 political parties within this country, uh, if we check size and membership, two major political parties, and then we get, we get the All Progressives Congress APC and the People's Democratic Party, the party where we say, before 2015, and then they government for 16 years. Now, interesting thing happened. For the APC only, get what they call affirmation. President Mohamed Buhari from the APC, all the APC people through direct primary, all of them come out, talk, say, now you go be our candidate. Mm. And the 7,000 delegates there, when come for inside the Eagle Square, and uh, that night, their own to say, yes, yeah, so we agree with waiting these 14 million plus APC members around the full country, don't talk. Uh, not too far away, in far small, but if you follow plane or private jetty, not too far. For inside Portacourt, for the Adoki Amas Yama Stadium, we happen for inside the capital, of a uh, river state, uh, PDP delegates to 3,000 plus, then gather together. And from 12 aspirants, they can choose Al Haji Atiku Abubakar, former vice president of Nigeria between 1999 and 2007, as the candidate of that party. I just said, I give you the summary of what happened this weekend. But it gets something will happen today as Al Haji Atiku Abubakar, accompanied by three people. When we say, if you talk of men of God, that they respect them, Sheikh Gumi. Bishop Oedepo and Bishop Matthew Kuka, uh, three of them follow him, go visit former President Chief Olushe Gwabasanjo. Why this visit? They're very, very extraordinary and special now because of, say, for a very long time, people, they talk and say, just like Tupac and B.I.G., they've been get beef. They say the former president and the former VP, two of them, they know they see eye to eye. In fact, their relationship, now like Tom and Jerry. But from the gist, when they come out from that particular meeting today, they say Chief Olushe Gwabasanjo, for the letter, when the media team put out, they say congratulate Alaji Ati Kwabubaka as the president to be of Nigeria. Now, whether if Chief Olusha Gwabasa just come and talk, say, eh, I support this person based on the way things there for Nigeria, it go influence the outcome of the 2019 elections. Make we put up on my say, now we the people that were hand the day. Mm. Now one man, one vote. One person no go vote two times. One man, one vote. Begin to think now. Who be that person when you believe, say, eh, if you lead this country, he go do well, make everybody inside this country belly sweet. Now, our first story on top of Aside, 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 hard. Yes, and my um, second story, I, with the first question I go ask, say, waiting me today's date. Today's date now, October 11. At least make a stick on that one. And every October 11 for every year, at least we they, we they actually dedicate them for a very special day. And waiting me this special day, International Day of the Girl's Child. 
And uh, every year, at least, uh, this event, they normally come out. Uh, they celebrate them across the world. And um, at least uh, the mayor to be say, would they, every year they celebrate um, International Day of the Girls' Child. How far? What will be the progress so far when, you, when we actually look the girls' child and um, the advancement and the development way and what they don't they get? Well, we could not even say they look at that country. We could restrict that down to our own country, maybe Nigeria. So far, so good. How go fit say we don't actually define at least the, the position of the girls' child for this Nigeria? Because if we really have to look at look uh, look at in different ways, at least in our education, where we say at least a lot they happen for North East. Let me say uh, a lot of girls now don't they discourage from not going to school to say insecurity they disturb them there. I've been uh, say girls when they early they, they marry when they give out to husbands on time at a tender age and all that. So these are issues, and especially this is what be the emphasis. It happen for rural areas, but the major thing we say at least uh, today. Where we don't actually look, where we don't say we dedicate for the girls' side. Make it be a day where we say at least we could always look, so okay, how do we advance towards improving the life of our daughters, the life of our, our sisters, the life of our aunties? That is, that the girls' child, they, that is because in the end, that they go eventually grow up to at least they fit into one particular position and also get married and also run a home. But now to take position then today, now you go fit define their position the way they will take present themselves tomorrow. And that's why I would say, make we always mark them at a day where we say, make we do it, make we give out a lot. When I mean a lot, both in, in, in visibly and in, in everything, make we just give out to ensure that at least uh, we raise the girl's child in our country, raise them well to the point of at least um, development. In continuation of the promise, because we will not be politicians, mm -hmm. <laughs> you know, say, if Nigerian politicians tell you, say, Merry Christmas. <laughs> just go outside, go. No. Go Merry, check your calendar. No, check your calendar first. Uh -huh. Whether you there for 2036 uh -huh. or you there for 2092. Mm. Uh, not be say we didn't have anybody. But the truth be say, since 1960, when Nigeria don't get independence, we don't they hear this, hear that. Oh, food for all, housing for all, this for all, that for all. But uh, as it be like this, now still suffering for all. <laughs> but we tell you now, say, out of these 91 political parties within this country, mm. we not go come talk, say, this party, nine big pass. That party, nine big pass. We don't mm. want no. We don't carry socialist party of Nigeria. Come here, SPN. Mm. We don't carry liberation movement, LM. And today we they bring ADP. Come inside studio. Now this ADP go talk about what in the party be. Go tell us why ADP as a political party they different. I make we put up for say we don't tell say from October twenty second, two thousand and eighteen. Every day I see the hot. Every day I see the hot. Mm. We never sure say before campaign go start proper and people go begin to look say okay we don't make up our mind for who we go vote for. We go don't bring all the ninety one political parties. Make them sit down to discuss and we promise when I say debate go day. Mm. <laughs> no no escape. Nothing like I don't want to debate. Mm -hmm. We go carry and come your house. Mm -hmm. If you don't tire to come studio, we go come meet you for house. Now the third matter we consign the party we won't go learn about today. ADP based on say. We want to make the full Nigeria see all these political parties and everything when the parties them they represent. And our final story got to do with uh, the Minister of Labor and Employment, uh, Dr. Chris Ngige. He don't come out and say, we no promise 30,000 naira minimum wage. Oh. They don't no promise them. And when they talk to them, they talk to them for the next which way, uh, where they hold them. Yesterday, when he come and talk, say, look, oh. they don't no make any say, they don't no say in, in ministry, no in any way reach any agreement with them. Uh, uh, the, the, the authorities of uh, the National uh, Nigerian Labor Congress say they don't even reach any agreement. Say, any, where they get their own information, say, say they don't say they don't know. Say the, the amount where they agree or what they even look, what they consider right now. According to what the minister told you, say, the, 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 this in the private sector, they even consider, say, now 25K. That's 25,000 naira. Neither will be paid for minimum wage. Why the federal government they look 24,000 naira? Why state on their own call they look how much? They look um, 20,000 naira. So now what they they look, see now what they don't even on their own part, see now what they don't consider. Uh, but then, if we also go look and um, ask uh, the, 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 the labor head, uh, that is um, Oga uh, Ayuba Waba, he talks to look, say they agree. See how this one they come and come talk, say they agree, see now 30,000 naira. Uh, well, who they talk through, we don't know. Who they allow, we don't know. But the major thing we say, make we see a concluding end, make we see a very good end, where we say, at least we will put better smile. Not be just her smile, but her smile in the, in the, in the faces of um, our workers, our papas, them, where they, where they say, where they work for government to ensure say, things work out well. Make we at least put that smile uh, for their faces. Now, our final story be that. Make we enter this small break.
When we go come back, our Ogbonga visitor, Honorable Taiwo Osoyi, mm. he go join us inside studio. I will go discuss all this matter we concern our great country, Nigeria, and also uh, carry your Bible now, or your pencil, or your paper to write down, because all these political parties, one after the other, mm. we go to break all of them down. No go anywhere, we they come back now, still as it is, as it is. Welcome back to Acid Heart. Let's go to Kudi Unkubi and our own guest visitor, Honorable Taiwo or Sonny, the inside studio. And when I go remember, I said, we'll be done promise when I since. Say all the political parties go get equal opportunity to come here and talk what in their political party they about. Uh, but before we even enter politic matter, maybe we enter the one when we say everybody inside the border of Nigeria go choke my out on top as it takes concern preparation for the 2019 general election. Uh, just before you join us, when we do the introduction, we talk and say uh, from everything when come out from the meeting between Chief Olusegun Obasanjo and uh, Al Haji Atiku Abubakar. When we say they say three men of God follow him, enter inside that meeting too, amongst other people. Uh, say it be like say uh, the quarrel went on there for a very long time. They don't settle them in the interest of this our great country, Nigeria. What will be your assessment of this meeting and uh, the outcome? Yeah. Good evening, everybody. Well, for me, the meeting are uh, waiting supposed to happen. Mm. Now waiting go happen with that because mm. if you look at the antecedent of waiting that happen before. We Obi don't write open letter to Baba Buhari. Mm. Say me come up for us when they climb. Say the time don't reach. So obviously, Obi go support another person. So it was already and the only, the parties that are probably known, the major parties that people will say is PDP or APC. So as P Baba don't leave PDP, APC back, he go go climb on top the house of a and PDP. So mm. now what go happen with that? It's not a new thing as far as I'm concerned, but. It is sad for me as an individual because um, as a young person, not only as a candidate of a political party or vying for office, but for the generation, for this youth, um, this young generation, mm. it is sad that we're having 70 year old plus men as our presidential candidate and everybody's clapping and praising God for it. Mm. Mm. Uh, well, uh, make, I, make I bring up from this angle. Um, but restricting it to this same visit we um I mean a large article back at Kari Waka. Um, a, a lot of people don't also don't question um, this particular matter. Uh, we get to do it, okay. Why would always they get an issue? I mean with the past president, Olushegaba, so you always say anytime we in don't get some form of fallout with a particular past president and um, to the look for another alternative option. Uh, some people don't say, say this particular move uh, waka from this place, enter here. See, now, for actually for the interest of the people, I've been for just personal interest. Because though we know, say, the, 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 the former president, he said, I'll come out, I'll try to talk, say, look, cool. say, now, waiting go better for Nigeria. And I ain't this grateful. for. But people go see the act, say, see, now, for true, true, waiting there in mind. See, now, for waiting go go good for the nation. I've been awaiting him. I've been awaiting be, uh, we go be of his own interest. And uh, now, he actually the grateful. for. Waiting, if you look at this assessment, what do you actually think about that? Well, me cannot lie. Um, as an individual, as a young politician, mm. I give kudos to OBJ. That's Olusha Gompa Sanjo, okay. anytime, any day. He's one of the people I look up to in Nigeria as one of the leading political leaders in Nigeria today. And anything where, if you look at the history, if you look at history, anything where Gompa don't talk, mm. it always play out for Nigerian political setting. Mm. However, if you put them side by side, political personal interest and national interest. At one point, if we talk to yes, OBJ did right at some point. But at some other point, if we talk to no, he did pursue your own personal interest. But be it as it may, it is obvious that even the blind man can see that this government, this current government has failed the people, has failed the nation, and has failed the general public of Nigeria. However, it is, it is important that there is, a, there is a need for a drastic dynamic in the Nigerian political system. So if Obasanjo talks, say, nah, say, you know they support this system again. Mm. For me, I don't see Atiku as also a credible alternative for the takeover of this government. Because the whole truth is this. We are shouting that youth should be in politics. 
We cannot perpetrate, we cannot pardon. 70, Article 72 years. Um, Buhari is 74 years. These people are supposed to be in their retirement age, collecting salary. Uh, and their salary. Make, make, we look, make we look young people. The truth be say, uh, not be just about age. Mm. Now you go make say, person get sense or you know get sense. Make we do fair. But like you, they emphasize, if we look Nigeria population, over 60% now 30 years and below. Meaning say, now young people, now in plenty pass. So if young people plenty pass, young people suppose they're involved in anything when consign their future, because now they go live inside the future. But like you talk, the major political parties, and like a politician, you know, say politics now essentially about structure. Party when we say, he gets here, mm. he gets there, mm. he did here, he did there. But we can't check these two major political parties. Go check how much they put their form. Now, President Mohamed Buhari will be the only presidential aspirant mm. when the APC. At least I know of Adam Garuba, mm -hmm. who will be 35 years old. I know of two other people. But the first time when they first put the money for 55 million, they first shout, say, what did happen? They go and talk, say, okay, they don't review him now, now 45 million. Even the president in talk, say, he no get that money. Now, some people don't look and say, these major political parties, in truth, uh, based on the structure when they get and the powers when they get, not be like say they really even they, they, they care about young people. Because how many young people go wake up one day if they look presidential, carry 45 million naira to go buy form, saying one lead this country. Now, we get other political parties because out of this 91, if you come out the two, now 89. Mm -hmm. These other 89 political parties, what do young people suppose they do as they concern, say, if these ones they don't put money for somewhere when we say our hand no feel rich, these other ones make we they enter them. They see how we go take it from. You think say young people even they interested in anything we concern politics? Yes, um, I've been a Twitter political party. No, and we did. Young, young people don't they interested because I, I don't go through my statistics. Right now, as it as we as I, I as of today, the um, the not too young to run are ready to run group. I brought out the analysis of the young people that are running. Unfortunately, the two major parties, APC and PDP, do not have, um, they have the least percentage, over less than 0.01% of candidates in their parties. Other parties, the 89 political parties, have a major share of young people running in office as candidates. Between, I, know, I know of a young man, although he is, he is running under the PDP of 25 years. I know someone that is 26. I know people that are 27. I know people that are less than 30 that are running for office, but they are not under the PDP and APC. Doesn't mean that the young people are not ready for governance, but it's all that the, this, these old people are trying to overshadow the young people with all their wicked policies so that the young people will not rise, so that they continue to run the country the way they have been doing for, hmm. for a long while. Hmm. So it's very, very clear, say, uh, young people are supposed to take their destiny inside their own hands. And all these complaints would always be complaints. Options day. Now, for us to open our eyes and look these options there and take advantage of us. Now, we're going to talk about the future of this country. We're going to talk about people when they're very, very special. Then they talk, say, if you build a man, you build a family. If you build a woman, you build a nation. Now, if people, they talk, say, education is the bedrock of a nation's existence. And according to a recent report, 13.2 million, around that figure, that will be the number of children who will get out of school. Based on, say, today, now, International Day of the Girl Child, make we look at our society. And see what in society, families, politicians, government fit do to use their show say, make we first start with children for this country, their future they secure. And if we want really secure the future of this our country, girl children, their future they secure. See, today now International Girl Child Day, mm -hmm. and I want to appreciate the United Nations for and other non-governmental agencies mm -hmm. for this wonderful day. But one thing I want to say is this. We need to begin to understand that education, without education and knowledge, this country cannot go anywhere. Mm. Just last two weeks, or last week, I met two young girls and one and two guys, young boys, or young children of about eight to 10 years on my street. What did they do? Did they pack, pack um, bottles, packets of bottles, water, and all these things? That was around after 11. A.M. A.M. When they're supposed to go to school. school. I can't walk, I, I walk out, go meet them and say, excuse me, I spoke to Yoruba to them. How are you guys doing? What's happening? You know, you're not supposed to go to school. They say they're day school. What's the name of your school? They tell me the name of the school. It is a um, um, government school just in my constituency there. I said, okay, why not know day school? They tell me, say, then the, 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 the no future. I said, if I catch you tomorrow, 
you know, go school. You know, go meet me for people. If you see the way they run, well, they, give me the reason when they give. They don't give me any, any. So they're not just. They don't go school. So and it just shows that people day, leaders day, people day, old people day. See those children they work but no, but I took it upon myself to go go meet the student. Now, if I tell you, those students now they day school every day because I don't go to school self. Go see them. Go make sure say they day school. That is what they call government. That's what they call government. It's not. It's easy to come and say that and make children go to school. But if people know and show say they day, how they go on day. Mm -hmm. So the the interesting thing is today the international children um, girl child day, which is good. But however, we need to ensure that we need to be preaching the sense of child of children going into school. I also we need to we, we need to also change our mentality and our approach that a particular position day for man, a particular position day for woman. Yesterday, because me, I always day for work. I sometimes they enter marwa, they enter bike. I can't enter marwa yesterday. They engage the marwa man. Say, Alpha. No, the man even bring one topic. Then even start the topic. Say, um, woman not supposed to be present for Nigeria. This and I say, why are you talk man? You need to say, and when woman get power, that they. I just say, don't talk like that. Mm. Say. Say, you know, see, the person where, where the head first bank, now waiting, now woman. Mm -hmm. The president of Germany, now waiting, now woman. The president of Croatia, now waiting. He can they talk, say, hey, for him, woman is not supposed to be president, woman is not to be governor. I, I give him that. You know, they think like that. Mm. Because these positions does not, is not entitled to a particular, mid, um, a particular gender. Mm -hmm. It is male and female. And everybody is entitled to that position. Mm -hmm. So until we begin to understand that, this this traditional mindset that women are not supposed they are or women are supposed they house they cook or as the president says that the 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 the, the, the office of the of the of the of the woman is the room and the other room. Uh, if we look at make I bring up from this angle, we, the reason one of the reasons why would they get um, would they assign responsibility give our leader that is who oh, they elect um, president they elect governor they re, re, they elect them um, house of rep members senator now because of see. Make their feet put out policies, maybe so well, as we go fit favor everybody. If we as a country, they among the countries where they celebrate um, a, a girl's day child, all they have to me, what in the, the try talk, we say, at least every two way concern, better we go favor the girls, at least uh, with the part of them. But looking at it in, in context, looking at it internally, we won't say, would they slide somehow, would they deviate from that particular thing where, where we also follow celebrate? How then can we also say, government to, because we're a part of this, and because we're, we have also vowed to be to support the girl's child, no matter the condition, how we how we also fit ensure say government on their own part, at least with the with the, with the people pushing for it, ensure say at least the right policies will go favor this, will go favor the girl's child, they put them in place, make with the stay they visible. Now, if we, one one thing we will suppose realize is say government they do their part, okay, but. It might not be enough. Okay. Let's appreciate that. Mm -hmm. But the fact we say, in, in as much as say we they put the responsibility on government, individuals also must accept to take responsibility. Now, on the aspect of government, look at security now. This mm. lady, Shaibu Lai, no, is still in, yeah. in custody of Boko Haram. And the government of Nigeria has not made a statement regarding to that girl's abduction mm -hmm. for almost how many months? Months, yeah. It's sad. It's it's it, 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 it's a shame to our security agencies and to our, our to the, I'm saying it with with all with all disheartening and with all sadness that but but, but, but lately, recently the president come and talks at least they come and confirm say he follow the parents of um, this um, um, Shaibu um, uh, this thing he uh, communicate and then he come and assure them say look say until we get to do it to, with my daughter so we we'll go make sure say we we'll bring them back if we they see such assurance coming from the president. They know also to say as a people who say okay, how then do we support the president to ensure say this girl come back to come, is, come back, come back this, to the this government don't talk enough a lot of things. They know they they, they, they know they talk. I don't want to yet talk again. I want to see action. Mm. I don't want to yet talk. This girl is a young girl of 15 years in abduction. Coming to meet me as a parent does not change my mindset that my child is an in, is in, in some ways yeah. being abducted. By some hooligans and Nikon Poos that uh, what they call, I call themselves terrorist group. And yet, I don't want to hear that again. I want to see actions being taken. I want to see them say that they have gone to so so and so place, aerocop, um, place of, um, are flying in some areas, and this girl, the, the search of Shaibula is, is in process. I don't want to hear Brian telling me that 
um, the girl is somewhere or they are going to uh, they are going to take the girl. I don't want to hear those stories. Those stories are so sweet to, to listen to. But let me hear action. Let me see actions. Very true. Eh? Like you talk now, action. I'm be the coco. It go good. Make we emphasize. Say eh, why we talk. Say the government when they do everything what they do to use rescue this girl. Mm -hmm. And when they do na work. Now na work oh, because if those eh, when I know the government nothing go concern with Anuna. And now na work. But we go emphasize. Say. So long as you did there, yeah, they work for us. Based on leadership by servitude, if we go by social contracts, we will continue to act sooner because we won't see results. And see, make I talk am here. And matter where we say, na problem when everybody from Nigeria they face. Mm. If another government come, now so the mouth we go just they keep them. Now so the talk go there because government exists in continuum. Yeah. And maybe we just discuss ADP as a political party first before we throw the phone lines. So we make una call and talk on our mind as it take concern this matter. And the ADP, Action Democratic Party, uh, people don't look and say, and uh, a party will be say, uh, they don't come out. They say uh, they won't change Nigeria and they won't make Nigeria make sense. And you will be young uh, politician. You say, if you don't come out and say, okay, oh, uh, you won't identify with this party. If we look on our logo, na hand, when carry book, I don't know whether that's in a book, I've been a Bible, I've been a constitution, but if you like say, it means say, that part in a party of say knowledge, uh, reading, information. Just explain me the full Nigeria and uh, get understanding of what the ADP is about. Okay. Um, Action Democratic Party is ADP, as you have said, is a party that was um, that actually came to play by around 2016, and it's a party that is driven towards one thing, which is the credible alternative. 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 Uh, that make you break and down. We say APC don't fail. PDP don't fail before mm. before. So we need Nigeria needs a new party. We go give them the face of what we call governance. No, we say person go just come, they talk story. They give us different, different things. When where everybody they hear, but no, they play action or not. And the ADP is a party where it, as you don't see. Our, our, our logo is improved with book. It's, it shows knowledge. Mm -hmm. You cannot be in governance, you cannot be in government without having knowledge about what is happening in your vicinity. And now what did happen between these two major parties? And this ADP has made it known that we are tired of this terrain, this mediocrity. We want to move beyond that. We want to achieve better results. And why the party came together to say, okay, very intelligent people came together and said, okay, let us form a party towards this path of success and f making people feel the effect mm -hmm. of governance. Mm -hmm. um, make, make I ask you, eh, if I need to pick them up from a few things where you don't talk, um, you, you talk, say, at least, uh, say, on a party day towards um, credible alternative, at least, uh, providing a, a better option. Um, as against what we get for grant right now. And you can also talk, say, at least, say, we get tired. If we look at um, some of these languages, where you don't use now, now the same language is where any political party where they come in place, like uh, a lot of people tell you, say, the ruling party right now, so they use a lot of such languages before they come inside power. You understand? If we really have to look at it, how could it be those things where you could really need to at least them? The people go on probably crave for a more broken down information. And how you want, how now political party will actually achieve some of the things we now want to achieve. So that they cannot just be say, we they talk on a surface, just like every other regulars. You understand? Because now, like a more deeper and understanding. Like, of, like, for example, now, SDP, mm. uh, Asian White, Beira, they say one of the things when they carry for head now, say, if they enter government, mm -hmm. every Nigerian family go get house where it makes sense. When people go there, so that people go there do say, okay, oh, landlord, oh, problem, oh, you get some political party will come at us and say, them, oh, once they enter, everybody free education. Now, ADP as a political party, waiting, uh, waiting, gone, 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 gone. Mm. Let, me, let me make a break and down this way. Mm. We have a gubernatorial aspirant um, candidate in Lagos. Okay. Okay. That is Babatunde Olaleri, but I'm also BOJ. Okay. Now, if I don't know, I mean, I would bring out the copy of the statement by the time I leave here. Now, there's a breakdown of what he wants to do in Lagos State. I'm using Lagos State as a case study mm. in Nigeria now. 
There's a breakdown of things he wants to do. One, we want to make tax accountable. We they pay tax heavily in Lagos State, but no government in Lagos has, has brought out the, the accountability of the tax we pay in these states. So that is, the, well, that is one aspect he wants to do. It's called the Badamosi Plan. Okay. Now, the Badamosi Plan is clear and clean. If you read it, if you go through it, you understand that. One, is about tax payment. Two, it talks about education. How do you build schools? This is a man that has, this is a, also talks about providing electricity, electricity in the state. This is a man that is a real estate man and has, and has provided constant electricity, 24 hours power supply in some communities for the past six years or more over that. And if he can do that in a small community, he believes that he can do it also in the state. Mm. So that is what he is, he is actually uh, work on moving ahead. Then for me, being a candidate of the party as well, I have my own manifesto, I have my own plans as well, which I want to also forge ahead, which going by the Badamosi plan, which also collaborates vis a vis with his own plan and my own plan. My own plan, for example, is to work on education. I want to make education attractive to the constituents. How do I make it attractive? Now, most people in my constituency believe that how many people they go to school? Okay, don't go to school, you don't come back. Waiting mm. don't happen. Mm. Nothing. So no work. No, no work, nothing. nothing. So nothing they, they attract nothing people. they attract people, they go to school again. Now I want to make education attractive. How is it done? It's not that it is a year to campaign to say I I'll contact they do what I suppose they do. Firstly, I want to I want to ensure that I collaborate with the NURTW, that is the National Union of Road Transport Workers, mm. to ensure that these students are moved from from their house or from the bus stop from 7 a.m. to 7.30 on a free transportation system every day. This is what we this is what these people enjoyed long years ago. I want also in the uh, institution, I want also to ensure that there is the uh, what you call it, the disposal of bursary. We know they hear bursary again. They did give bursary before now. I want to ensure that Lagosians in my constituency, a Tiosa, uh, have the power to get work or a bursary as a student of higher institution. Also, so there are plans. So that one go encourage, encourage person people to say, okay, to say okay, okay, at okay. least so if my papa and mama don't get the money, oh, mm -hmm. this school when they go now, at least because if I feel bad, for example, you can say, okay, oh, uh, exam, get this, maybe get three A's, you go collect this particular mm -hmm. money. That is it. And we get somebody from Portacourt, uh, Sheung. Sheung, good evening and welcome to <laughs> Acid Heart. Yeah, good evening. My name is Charles Good evening, Good evening, Sheung. Good evening, Sheung. Talk to us, we they hear you. Yeah, good evening. Good evening. Yeah. Share, I beg, give your TV there and bring on the volume down, I beg. Okay, thank you. Okay, please. This uh, uh, our politician. Mm. Uh, I over uh, uh, your discussion, your people discussion. You okay. see, we are tired of what you say, uh, all these people. Look, just look at what is happening in Lagos State uh, in case of uh, this uh, Tinobu. Tinobu, being the governor of Lagos State, and what is happening there, bringing another person to, uh, to what are they calling the party, the mm -hmm. APC. I don't know what are they calling it. Mm -hmm, you mm -hmm. see, all the dudes that are talking, all these are talking, 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 so we are tired of, we are tired of them. We are tired. Look at this, my brother, that is talking about that. They have a, what is this, uh, another party they call it, that they want to bring, you know, you have your own agenda. All of them, they are not, they are not deceiving us. They don't have any, any team for Nigeria. They are not deceiving us. See, we are tired. Just imagine what uh, happened uh, to you. Yeah. Okay, may I ask, may I briefly ask you this question? If you say you don't get tired of even parties where you never, you never probably experience their leadership, what do you go crave for as an individual to ensure say things go well for uh, for, for for Nigeria? Please come again. I can't hear you clearly. I say if they if you don't talk, say you get tired about political parties and even the ones where you never even witness their leadership, what do that where you go crave for? What do that sense of leadership or that where you go crave for? That kind of sense of leadership where you really want for your country or for your state? Uh, thank you, my brother. See, uh, according to what you said, that uh, the kind of leadership that uh, uh, how you, I don't know how you put it. See, let me tell you, if uh, I didn't mean this our uh, this our past uh, leaders, what is his name? Um, Yara Dua. Mm. Yara the head. Yara is a kind of person that is a kind of man that we need. Mm. In this our country, the kind of look at look at when he, when he, when he was when he, when he was with alive. Look at what he did. He, he, he gave a uh, uh, amnesty. Just imagine, just look at what he did. And mm. this is our brother. Uh, what are they calling? Me? What are they calling his name? Uh, the one that was, uh, was in, um, Jonathan. 
Look at him. He deviates from what, from what this man created. So leave all these people. They are not deceiving us. We are, we, look at what happened. Just you mind what happened in my area today. A, a man, a man, a hardworking man, that is why he paid. Almost 18,000, 18,000. He cannot afford to pay, to pay for his, for, 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 to, to, to leave his wife from hospital. Just imagine what is happening in our country. Hmm. Agatheon, thank you very, very much uh, for this, your contribution. Um, 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 Honorary, may I ask you this question? If we need really, really need to look at Sheon's uh, reaction, you're going to say now, uh, in the, in the, he's like um, a voice of somebody who will say, we don't get tired already, we don't get proud. I'm not going to use the word frustrated about uh, leadership in general for Nigeria. Eh? But at least, how then do we also highlight or probably ensure, say, um, make people fit or at least feel identify what what they want and also feel look out for that kind of leadership where they really crave for so i think if you bring that kind of thing that sense of development where they want well um on um Ogashio, mm. i i heard what you said and i feel very sad as well for the family that cannot mm -hmm. pay that but however one thing we we need to understand is this nigerians must begin to take these leaders and owe them to a responsible government. Now, these people will not come if they don't know what is happening to mm -hmm. you. If you get a representative for government for your area, you have elected him. For me, he's your slave. He's not your, he's not your boss. Servant, yeah. He's your servant. He's supposed to serve you. And if, whenever he comes to your place, all you could do is to aid him, Honorable, um, His Excellency, mm -hmm. and you don't ask him questions on what have you done, what are your achievements, and all you people are waiting for is, uh, as Honorable they go, or as President they go, tips. may I give you tips. Then you don't collect, I've never seen a child where his father wrote his will, his father gave him the will, and comes back to the actual under will. Hmm. It's not possible. So when Nigerians and the, the population, the populace need to begin to understand that these people are servants and not, and not, they're supposed to serve you people and not because they are just there as, as, as demigods or mini gods, mm -hmm. as some people have created them to be. Uh, I mean, honorable, just say, uh, hold on, we got under person with their telephone line. Ladi, good evening, welcome to us in the hall. Good evening, Kobe, Abi. Yeah, we uh, greet you. Good evening to everyone of you. Good, good evening. evening. Please, eh? Uh, both the program and everything, I'm, a, I'm just begging. I'm just appealing. If we are contributing to this program, it's not for fun of it. Okay. And we wish that whatever we are discussing on this program, you people table it at Abuja for us. See, I'm not against anybody standing in for anything. Mm. But my problem in this country is this. If we are practicing democracy, Please let us pa practice it with God fearing. Mm. And we need to start from grassroots. Mm -hmm. That people don't point, you, you want people to go and represent us, and we don't know the people, we don't even know them in our village or our environment. They will go there because we are living in a, a, a less privileged area like Ogi. You just uh, take somebody we don't know, it's not even. Part of us, you just the, the next you will see is that the person is in the house representing the cookie notes mm. or cookie is, is mm. wrong. And again, see if we should beg, help us beg the present go, uh, government. Mm -hmm. They have everything to, to take to go around to check what their governors are doing. Yeah, you have been receiving himself this today now that the uh, uh, PD, uh, PD, PDP are calling me to APC in Kogi said this and that. Can the government look for people and go and check what Yayabelo is doing for us in Kogi State? Mm. Why are we doing this to ourselves for crying out loud? Mm. We are tired of story. Hmm. Yeah, Daddy, this talk where you don't talk now and a very important one. We are tired of story. By we, you mean the Nigerian people. people. Now, why would they talk, say, make everybody they participate actively? Watch us see the heart. Call, Have talk. You? Nobody to just talk about the problem. Talk about so, uh, solution mm -hmm. to this problem too. I make we work hard to see say our country makes sense. That I make I let you know. Now. That is uh, what we are saying. I uh, make I let you know, sir. People when they Abuja, then sit down, then they watch us because 
Uh, then they rush us as we did at least on the show. Then they call us to tell us, say, we they hear, we they walk, but we know they hide mouth. And I go see, say, uh, even if uh, the one with the boy, did they go come here or because uh, we they expect her? Did they go come here? As we take all these questions, so that's all we could take the ask her. Uh, thank you very much for that call. We get another person on top of our telephone line. Good evening and welcome to Ask the Heart. Michael, good evening. Michael, are you there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I beg, Michael, bring the volume of your television down, I beg. Hello? Could they hear you? All uh, right. Good evening. Good evening, Michael. This is Michael calling from Lagos. Okay. The other guy that called the uh, show, he said he was tired. Mm -hmm. So now my own contribution for all this is that all the political parties, according to what uh, Uche said, he said, what can you do when you see that you are tired of all the political story? Mm. Now what me, my own suggestion is that when you see that you are tired of, of two, three, for a political party. Mm -hmm. But for me, I can just say, okay, let me give another party a try. Mm -hmm. Like saying, you know, okay, this ADP now. Mm -hmm. I'll just say, okay, even if it is only my vote they receive, I know that my whole mind is clear. And I will say, okay, let me give them this and give them a try. Mm -hmm. So if I can see two or three um, individuals that can say, okay, let's give other people try it. So that all this political party uh, problem that we are having, that they are giving us stories on the unrelevant stories that doesn't make sense mm. to us. We need someone that can stand up. If we are saying that everyone is the same, we will never be able to bring out one person. Exactly. Like we said, okay, this person can do it. But we need to do what? Give everybody tired. Because me, as my own is now, I'm, ab I'm about uh, 20, 20. Now, as a 27 years old man, can see if you have a brain enough to face the crowd, yes. you can stand for yourself and make everybody know that, okay, this, this, this is our country. We need a more than change. Exactly. We need more than change. We don't need, we just, we don't need else. Very okay. true. And we okay, Michael, we appreciate anybody. this, your important contribution. Thank you very much, Michael. Go good, make me also emphasize, say, when we they talk about leadership, most times everybody go say, eh, Abuja, governor, mm. senator, honorable, and eh, are true. But make we check out. If you check the way when we say society day, the smallest unit for society, not the family. If every family them, you know, do well, take care of children well, give them own training, it go there easy when people come out. Because the small, small good work go to show for our society. He get the time when we say our papa then will tell us, say, if they, they will tell their kid, remember the child of whom you are. Mm. Whether your papa get money or you don't get or money, you get, if yes. you remember that good name of the family, you go to behave yourself. You don't go want to do anything when you go bring that name to shame. Now, maybe we can't look political family now. The smallest unit now, the word, W A R D, word. Make we begin the look self, say, from as small as the world, who be the person when they there? Who go come and talk, say, won't be our counselor? Now, person, when we say, for landlord uh, tenants association meeting, he don't chop contribution of security money before. Our final caller, Kingsley, before we go allow Honorable Taiwo and uh, wrap up the talk. Kingsley, will they hear you? Oh, okay, will they hear you? Talk. Uh, Wait till me, I get up now, you these political people, the way you don't they come see, you don't tire all of us. Mm. What do we really want? This ADP, when you come, what will they see new faces? Mm. We want these new faces to come. Mm. Because all these old people, the way they don't they, it's like they, they turn up, up and down. Today, then they APC. Tomorrow, now they go to come to PDP. Next, tomorrow, they don't go for another one again. We don't tire. As new faces, they come. We want to see these young people. Make them grow up. Correct mm. the mistakes. When you say you don't stay inside this our country, Nigeria, mm. we won't make them bring the glory of Nigeria back to this country. Mm. Now, what do we want here to do that? Thank you. 
Thank you very, very much, uh, Madam Christie, for that um, contribution. Um, on that particular note, um, we don't hear Madam Christie talk. At least she did crave for um, a particular, at least in Nigeria, we say, if we look in the past, how Nigeria take be before, we say, at least uh, we get young people, we say, a lot of our leaders, if we look back to when they start, they started very young, but a lot of them can't remain to the one day stuck to the system. How then do we at least maintain that, that, that youthful aid in leadership? Not just maintaining a youthful age, but maintaining a youthful age with a sense of leadership we will really go around, we will really affect everybody's life. Okay. Um, <clears throat> one thing is for the youth to participate. Mm -hmm. Another thing is for them to be voted in by mm. the people. Mm. Right now, the ball is in the constituent court to choose between a man that possess his achievement at putting, putting, putting Bo'o into God as, as his own achievement and putting a young man that has a very large plan and a very crystal ball plan for the constituency. Now, the problem is this. I keep telling people, the youth want to serve, but are the youth ready to cooperate with the youth? Hmm. That is a big question. Hmm. And the answer is no. Now, if I go meet old mama, mama, I beg, vote for me, hmm. now me be ADP, Candidate mm. for us of assembly. Mama go to the doctor, say, ah, oh, mommy, my picking, you go better, for, I go vote for you. If I go meet my co youth, say, I beg, go, oh, men, Afana, I beg, men, I vote for me. Oh. I become, they just say, older, where is money? Bring money. Oh, laughing Dibo, it is money I want you to vote. Now, that is where the problem comes into play. Because the old people have this money to waste. To give them, but to vote you, for what them. What do they do to convince these young people? Now, the thing I'm because it, well, if we check them, in all honesty, mm. uh, plenty of people feel say the only thing when they collect from those when they government. Now, when they come beg us for our vote, now why the person go Google look say I I mean Google be my own government. I provide my own borehole. I pay for my security. I defoil my generator. Just bring this money come during election. Make I see now my own share be that. What do you do or what do you go advise be say? Maybe we use that and they convince these young people so that they're going to say, no, be oh, oh, laughing deep. Now, the thing we say, and, 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 and what time they do, now what I don't they do with that? And they make them see, say, and they feel their pain. And they, you know, we say, what do you call it? And they do, just on Sunday, last Sunday, I did inside rain. They, they see me. You no, know, I, 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 I use convoy, I use Jeep or something. They saw me, my, my, some of my constituents saw me. And they said, ah, honorable, oh, do not pain. That's the rain beat you. I said, yes. So far, he's beating people. It has to beat me. Mm. So it's not so the they say, say I they feel their pain. It's not that well. So until until the until the people until the people realize or start begin the, the, the people begin to understand that if you are not in my pain, you cannot solve my pain. Mm. I know what my people need. Mm. I know how, how I'm going to solve it for them. Mm. But you cannot compare somebody that has eaten and is comfortable and is full and wants to waste money around. And it's because for your vote, and you think I said that one is going to save you, it's not possible. He has already paid you his dividends of democracy for you by giving his money. Mm. So that's what I, I keep telling people. Anybody will come give you money to vote for him. If he win the election, no expect me to do anything for you. Mm. Because you don't collect the money where you're supposed to do projects. Mm. You don't collect the money where you're supposed to execute something for you. So you do, you, you be like a person where you don't chop in afternoon food for, for money. Mm. So you're not supposed to expect any food for money for afternoon. Mm. So and, and, and those are the things I keep telling the people. And until we begin to understand that from that perspective, say money is not about it's not the money you collect from these mm. politicians. The money you collect from these politicians is the money they have in in, in essence. So they are ready to waste it on you people and not do anything for this you. This is why you don't talk now. What you even they call words of marble? If you don't feel my pain, nothing where you go feel do to solve that pain. Now you get this handshake, collect them. Thank you very much. Say you come, come spread the message of ADP. We talk and say. Every political party, the 91 of them, will give them opportunity to talk their mind on mm -hmm. top of this place and mm -hmm. let Nigerians uh, choose for themselves. Exactly. Remember, say, like we they talk now, one man, one vote. Mm -hmm. Now all of us go come out, participate in order to make our country better. Exactly. Government, when they do well, to see, say, suffering, no day, mm -hmm. hunger, no day, mm -hmm. security day, peace mm -hmm. day. Mm -hmm. Now the government, now the people of Nigeria go come out to support because not the only government that do the work. Exactly. We self go do our own. Exactly. You don't talk and finish, my brother Chukudi. And um, it did our hand to do it into this side. Why they do like you? You say I don't talk and finish. You still they talk again.
Now the problem when I don't the girl with you, you don't talk and finish. No, they go. You don't talk and you call they talk. Why they deceive me? You, you see the same thing when they talk. New new party, new people. Now we want new people. Our people went there for us. So they will come back again on Monday. I know, I know, I know you. Topic, eh? I know you. How you go talk, say I talk, finish. Why you talk people? again? So, so I belong to the old. Is that what you're saying? You, of course, you don't go back to your old dressing now. You don't change your dress before now suit you they wear. Now you don't begin to change. Only God knows what they give you. If he hides something on that year. <laughs> Our people went there for our something. We come back again on Monday with another topic where they come on smoke. On a live band. To enjoy more of this, our Ugonke videos when you just watch, press this button to subscribe on top of our YouTube page. You go love her.